Today at the Capitol, a group of outraged protesters organized by university students gathered to protest the passage of House Joint Resolution 12, which has gained national attention recently for labeling global warming as, quote, a conspiracy, and for declaring Utah's opposition to policies that deal with climate change. An assortment of environmental groups, concerned scientists, students, and many others were joined by former mayor of Salt Lake City, Rocky Anderson, to express their opposition to House Joint Resolution 12 and to demand that Utah's legislature heed the warnings of the international scientific community. There is no longer any scientific doubt that the Earth's average surface temperature is increasing and that changes in ocean temperature, ice and snow cover, and sea level are consistent with this global warming. There's absolutely no conspiracy. This notion of climate gate that has been put out there in the media is the result, frankly, of two of thousands upon thousands of emails that were released through legitimate or illegitimate uh, ways. And a few of them have been cherry picked and used by the PR climate denial machine to suggest that there is some sort of large conspiracy, which there isn't, within the legitimate scientific community. HDR 12 and 21 are message resolutions which basically say Utah does not think CO2 is an issue or a problem. Politics is about making the right choices at the right times. And we're here today because our own legislature is about to make the wrong choice. The real message these bills send is this. We have coal, coal is cheap, coal is important to our economy, therefore let's continue business as usual. What's been going on here in the context of climate change le legislation with, with HJR 12 and the other one, it's, it's just, it's absolutely baffling. There, there's, there's no scientific logic to any of this, okay? And to be perfectly blunt, the rest of the world, I'm getting emails on a daily basis from professional colleagues all over the world asking me what in the hell is wrong with your state legislators. This is something that sends the wrong message to people. If our state is not willing to accept the harmful impacts from CO2, then what message does that send to the country? The rest of the United States understands that this, these issues are not going away. Human generated increases in greenhouse gas concentrations are responsible for most of the global warming observed during the last 50 years and that ongoing greenhouse gas emissions at or above current levels will likely result in a decline in Utah's mountain snowpack and the threat of severe and prolonged episodic drought in Utah is real. Those are the consequences. We are doing everything we can to attract quality jobs here in Utah, green jobs, and that is a concern among all of us. I was not told I would only have two minutes to speak in front of this subcommittee. Two minutes! Two minutes! Everyone that came, including our esteemed Rocky Anderson, had two minutes. Do you see a problem with this? Okay. When we all arrived the morning of February 19th, Representative Gibson, who is behind HJR 12, due to the, pro the political process, introduced the bill and spent about 30 minutes with two of his esteemed colleagues giving presentations, PowerPoint presentations, full of, frankly, full of lies, full of empirically invalid statements that lack any scientific merit whatsoever. This went on for 30 minutes, 30 minutes. How are we who are here out of concern for the lack of scientific legitimacy in HDR 12 able to respond within two minutes to 30 minutes worth of BS? Okay, then after this went on, they decided to show a commercial from the Super Bowl about the green police, quote unquote. This was attempted to be humorous. This is where I'm taking the kid gloves off. I'm sorry, but I gotta do it. As someone who's been studying international environmental inequalities for a decade, I respectfully ask Representative Gibson 
to go visit the half-dead villages on the coast of Bangladesh, where families point to a distant place in the rising ocean and say, do you see that chimney sticking up? That's where my house was. I had to abandon it six months ago. Go and visit these people and see if they think that this is a funny issue or a lighthearted issue. Go stand on the borders of the dried out dark board and hear refugees explain. The water dried up, and so we started to kill each other for what was left. Former Mayor Rocky Anderson led the charge on behalf of all the groups who had assembled on Capitol Hill to hand deliver letters of concern with over a thousand signatures from members of the community to each and every member of the Utah House and Senate. While attempting to deliver the letters of concern on behalf of the citizens group, tension ran high when former Mayor Anderson and the activists were confronted by one of the resolution's chief advocates, Republican Representative Mike Noel. This heated exchange ensued. You got all the young, impressionable kids, huh? I'm not against clean energy, okay? Don't try to put that on me because I'm not against clean energy. But I don't consider CO2 as a pollutant, okay? Unless you buy into anthropogenic glo global warming, which I don't. I'm not saying the climate's not changing. I'm just saying that I don't think CO2 has that much to do with it, okay? And there's a lot of people out there that believe the same way I do. Okay, this isn't a matter of belief. The intergovernmental well, panel on climate change. Intergovernment, go ahead, the, go ahead. The every single nation's science academy, industrialized nation's science academy, including our own, okay. our own meteorological association okay. in this country, top Utah scientists, dozens of them, okay. are all in agreement. Right. Like the Himalayan glaciers are going to melt no, in 35 years? This is, this they're, they're not. not. They are melting. They are melting. I suggest what that you IPC, look at the. What did the IPC report say? I suggest that you. I suggest no, that you look right. at the World right. Glacier He's Monitoring wrong. Service. Wrong. The They're World Glacier big, Monitoring oh. Service, which is which is a very oh, reputable organization. Face, okay? I'm not pointing my finger. Yes, you are. Okay. 